Uh, okay, hey YouTube, um, I'm just gonna make a quick video because today, well, pretty recently, I, I have a new puzzle. This is my 9x9x1, and I know I have pretty bad video quality, so I've got this flashlight so you can see it better. See? Nine layers by one layer. Um, hopefully I'll have a better video up sooner, um, or in, in some time. Just cause I like screwed up my computer. Uh, yeah, but that's a number number one. I just recently built this. If you were at a contest recently, you saw it in white. I've been waiting for stickers to present this, but mm, I don't have them done yet, and I just sort of got bored. So I'm, you can see it now. Uh, this puzzle uh, is very misproportional, just cause it has to be. But it turns very smoothly. Here, I'll turn each layer. Mm, you can see that pretty well. Or actually, you can't see that pretty well. Put it back. But yes, it is a nine layer puzzle and it is fully functional. There's going to be a video with stickers soon. Uh, one thing I want to say about it though, it's not that stable. Mm, it'll fall apart just because it's plain linear mech. It doesn't even have like V rails. Um, if I could redesign this, I'd make these cuts deeper. I uh, go deeper in because they're pretty shallow. Uh, uh, and I don't want to take up pieces because it'll be a mess. Mm, so it'll pop sometimes and. I guess you could compare this to the 9x9 nine nine for popping. Like, it pops very similar. When it pops, it has big pops and it's a pain to assemble. I don't know, I've never turned a 9x9, nine nine, but I've seen reviews and stuff. Yep, so that's my 9x9x1. Nine nine uh, there's gonna be stickers on it soon, hopefully, when I get them done. But I'm working on other stuff right now. And I'll make stickers eventually. One. We can't want to board. Okay, so see you guys later. Other videos.